guys welcome back to the channel in today's video is going to be on the on get ready with me that i promised you guys on my last two videos that i was gonna do here i am it is nine o'clock right now my makeup is just a mess already yes it could last longer i know that but i'm just ready to take makeup off so yeah you guys without further ado let's just go ahead and get started So the first thing is obviously put our hair back so we don't have anything on our faces. Just pull it back, do a bun, do whatever you like really, nothing fancy. Taking off my earrings, that's that. Taking off my lashes. And then now um, to take off the makeup, basically to melt it. Um, so this is the one that we got for the Boxy Charm box. Um, I've used this two times already, as you can see. It is used. I like it but not like not not but not to start taking off my makeup because I feel like for my eyes especially like I feel like this product just does not work for me like yes it takes off the makeup but I don't know something is like like I don't know something bothers me after I take off the makeup and stuff like I just feel like I have something inside my eyes um, I don't know I just don't like this to like for my eyes and stuff but for the rest of the skin is fine but what I would do first is basically go in with my coconut oil you can find this at Target I mean any coconut any any organic coconut oil will work so um, yeah it doesn't have to be this one but as you can see mine is really used I almost have to buy a new one but um yeah that's what I'm gonna use to melt everything on my skin even my eyes so I just get this amount and basically massage it into my hands to warm it up I've been using coconut oil for the longest time now it it does not affect my skin in any type of way um just have it have that in mind every everybody's skin is different this is what I use for my skin I don't know about you but if you want to try to go ahead you're more than welcome but yeah so it looks like this now I'm just gonna be massaging it into my skin Right, so now <clears throat> I like to take a uh, uh, not a makeup wipe I usually use this wipe right here you can find this at Walmart basically I'm just gonna be wiping everything off Alright, so once it's done you guys now I like to go in with a cleanser um, <clears throat> this right here the one that we got in the boxy charm box this is why I am using it like on the second place because I feel like because this is also a cleanser so it's gonna do it's gonna take off any residue or anything and it's also gonna cleanse your skin I just take a little bit and then go ahead and massage it to my skin as well. I like to put a little bit on my neck too to remove any excess makeup down there. And then I'm going to go in with a towel, with a paper towel, basically wet it and 
wipe everything off So this is what I have left on my skin. I'm sure there's more. I mean, this is why I like to go in, not always, but I like to exfoliate my skin the majority of the time or go in with a mask after it. Okay, so it's this one right here. And uh, this is the Dermovia Lace, Lace Appeal with compression with, with compression technology black bamboo charcoal peel off mask this is what it says on the front basically it says step one cleans cleanse and dry face which i have done um it says for the second step apply an even an even layer of peel paste to targeted areas avoid eye area eyebrows hairline and lips all right step three line up holes with eyes nose and mouth press lace mask to area where pill paste is applied okay comes it comes with two of these this is the lace that comes with it this this looks like um like you know very private underwears uh yeah, th this looks pretty weird if you ask me. But this is basically how it looks. You will put you would you would put it on like this and put these things over your ears so the way um, it can stay there. But let's just go ahead and move on. Let's just apply the mask. I'm gonna be applying it with my finger better. Oh, this kind of burns. Oh, this is very, very strong. I'm going to go ahead and add this. Alright, so... It's all pressed. Now I'm just going to go ahead and set the timer for 20 minutes. I will be right back after 20 minutes and see how my skin is going to look after this. I don't know. Alright you guys, so I'm back and I can barely even talk with this on. Um, let's just take it off. Like I really want to take this off. Alrighty, it's been like 30 minutes already to be honest with you guys. So, let's see. Oh, this is oh, uh, this is a little bit painful, you guys. Oh, uh, all right. Oh, this is painful, you guys. So painful. Oh, and it's like itchy on my skin. I'm just going to go ahead and wash my skin with warm water like they suggested. So, I'll be right back. All right, you guys. So, oh my God. As you can see, my skin is like a little bit red, like irritated because of that mask. Uh, yeah. Not in love with that mask, you guys. If you don't want to, if you don't like the pain, please don't use this mask. Please don't buy it. But one thing I will say, though, like my skin feels like really, really soft. Like really really soft like I don't even know how to explain it but it feels like super soft around this area here and wherever I apply the mask anyways you guys uh, the next step that I like to do after a mask is basically exfoliate my lipstick this is the elf lipstick 
basically it's a it's an exfoliating exfoliating lipstick basically take a napkin and take this away now now it's time to um, do the skincare that I always use I'm using my Neutrogena pore refining toner it looks like this and I'm just gonna pour it in this cotton thing and basically apply it all over my skin <clears throat> alright so now uh, for serum I'm just gonna be applying this one right here this is from aloe pure skincare this one we got on a boxy charm one time I remember and ever since I have been using it okay you guys so my skin is like pretty irritated right here because of the mask I feel like it's very harsh on the skin I wouldn't suggest this mask like to put it all over maybe like over here like on the very center of the skin I think that will be pretty good for that mask but not for the not for this area right here I feel like my skin is a little irritated anyways for moisturizer I'm gonna go in with my Cetaphil daily advent lotion it looks like this this is a very moisturizing lotion I love this lotion have been using it for years also to my neck all right so now to, <clears throat> all right so now i'm just gonna be applying the, the the this vitamin e oil for my under eyes this is what i use for my under eyes usually to keep my under eyes moisturized and when winter comes you guys like I t I will definitely like drench my skin in this because it's very good for your skin and it's just amazing I like to apply right here on my on these fine lines that I have over here uh, because sometimes that tend to be a little bit dry up there so I like to apply it there and go over these edges right here of my mouth like so put it on my brows this rose water mist basically and apply that all over my skin alright so that's basically it for my skin and then for my lips I just like to apply the Carmex just the classic lip balm and apply that all over my lips and then I just like to you know let that dry before I go to bed because you know um, you don't want to apply the product and then go straight to bed you want to you know let it dry for a little bit so you don't like rub it all over your pillow uh, my skin is pretty irritated like for real like I want to zoom in so you guys can see this but look at this redness right here it's like little bumps on my skin because of that mask I feel like it is a very very intense you have very 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 sensitive skin sensitive skin I don't know if you're gonna like that mask that came on the boxy charm box uh, but I like it but not for these areas I like it for like the very very center I feel like it pulls everything out I don't know but for these area right here the rest of this the skin I don't recommend it alright you guys so like I promised there we go there is um, the products in function the the bomb and also the uh, mask 
you guys know my thoughts already and basically that's my skincare I don't use anything fancy or anything like that you know one day maybe I will definitely you know upgrade my skincare routine and all that but for now this is what I can afford and uh, what has worked for me for years these are my like staple ones now so um yeah this is all i have to say for this video i hope you guys enjoy please give a thumbs up if you did subscribe and i will see you in my next video bye